It's that magical time! Welcome to my house. Jamin Jackson here. It's that time of year, folks. I get to watch Lindy Hop at big event competitions. There's a big event called ILHC, and I'm excited to watch a lot of videos. This is the first video, and it looks like it's one of my favorite competitions, the solo jazz in Charleston competition. This isn't the highest level in terms of like what they call invitational level, um, but this is the highest level where I feel people are really competing and they're wanting to say something. So I wanna give my thoughts on this video. I haven't seen it yet, so let's get right into it. And go! The point of making tennis band. That announcer, oh, that's Peter Strong. Love his accent. Uh. Okay, who's who, who's who? Oh, I see Christian from the mouth. And I see Claudia. Oh. There's a lot of faces I don't know, which is great, because I want to try to look at this for what they're doing and not necessarily for what I think they should be doing, right? <clears throat> Get it, Christian? Ooh, I like how the band, the tempo's not too fast. They can kind of play a little bit in that groove. Oh, oh. Come on, man. Like that was a warm up. Let's see. I don't know what I think so far. Everybody looks like they're ready to dance. Nobody's really doing anything out, outside of the normal in those warm ups. Well, let's see what's up. Let's see. Let's see who goes first. All right, everybody. We've only got nine competitors now. Oh, no, we're back. Okay, good. We got the performance enhancing beer here. Here we go. All right, so <laughs> performance enhancing yeah, beer. As <laughs> go out there. It's going to be jam style. We're starting off with Gabby. We're jam going style. Down. You're going to go twice through. Each time you will get half a chorus. Ooh, this is going to be dirty. Let's see what happens. Eight, eight, Gabby Cook, she's going to come out throwing it, folks. She's 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 one of my favorites. Swinging out to the end to the best of your solo abilities. Swinging out to the end. I'm sure you hear it. It's two eight counts. Gabby, take the stage. Come on, Gabby. Let's see what's up. She's gonna come out, folks. Don't don't let her. She looks cute, but she's gonna come out with tiger uppercuts. Here we go. Hup, hup. Uh, come on now. Like that? <laughs> Come on, Claudia. Ah, oh, like a rhythm. All right, who is this? Oh. Yes, like that transition. That was that was good. She's in heels too. Get it. Huh. 
Come on. Yes, so much energy. Hmm. I wonder how much of these sets are choreographed or if it's just like just going into it, improvised. Yes! I like weird. There we go. Is this my boy Rico? I think it is. Oh. Come on, Christian. Yes! I love it. It looks so natural. Wait a minute. The Studio 88, hello. I didn't, he had his facial hair. I didn't even recognize him. Come on. Uh. Round two. Monster at Charleston, folks. This is a tough one. For that, bro. Backflips with dress shoes on. Leather soles. He doesn't love his life very much. Huh. Come on. He's coming out swinging. I love it. I love it. Uh. Oh, I gotta take some notes. This is too good. It's too good. That last one's my first. We'll, we'll see what happens. Come on. Uh. Come on. That transition. Oh. Let's see if someone does something outrageous.
job, guys. That was good. That was good. That was good. Oh, let's give it up. Give it up. Give it up. I don't know, guys. This is that was a good one. That was a good one. That that level of Charleston is interesting because all of the dancers can dance. So how are you going to judge them? Like, what are we looking at? Like, you don't like their outfit or I don't know. Man, that was good. One of the things I like to look at is how different a person looks as opposed to everybody else. But not like in a desperate way. Not like, hey, you know, I'm trying to be different. And, you know, it's kind of sloppy and stuff. Or they're just doing like choreographed things. Um, I'm more into the weird, weird control, different relaxed style of solo jazz. And it seemed like there was a few people. I, I, I think the top three for me was the guy in the suit, yellow hair guy, I like to call blonde hair yellow. Yellow hair guy, I believe his name was Christian. It's my boy. And I'm somewhat biased because I do know his name. And then uh, the girl in the blue shirt, Claudia, I liked her because she wasn't just doing the same old moves everybody else was doing. She was doing like rhythmic stuff where, of course, everybody was dancing in rhythm, but she was doing rhythm in the sense where I could hear it. You know, if I was there and I was a tap dancer and I listened and I heard her do a rhythm on the floor, she would stand out to me. And she did because I do some tap dancing. But that was a good one. That was a good one. I would have put her probably in, in second place. And... Um, yeah, I think I would have put Christian. Christian in first. Just because. Just because he wasn't doing too much. And it was well balanced. Balanced in the sense that, hey, he's not trying to get my attention. He's just kind of being himself. And I could feel this just authentic nature of his dancing. Made me want to just watch him the whole time. Just because he wasn't like trying too hard. And I don't know, maybe that's just me, but I like it. I liked his. I also liked the guy Rico. His stuff is good too. And I really like, he was doing a little toe touch. I don't know if y'all remember that rhythm, but he wasn't just doing the toe touch. He was doing it like on beat. And I like that. So he probably, for me, would have had third. Yeah, it would have been Christian. That's my top three. Christian, Claudia, and Rico. That's, yeah, that's, if I was judging at ILHC. If I was there and I was judging, that's literally what I would have done. <sighs> but since it's my house, that's all that matters. That's what it should be. That's the order of those who should have won the competition. I don't know, I think the event's still going. So we'll see who wins. I'll take a look at that. But anyway, on to the next video. What did you guys think of this one? Solo Jazz, I like it. It's awesome. If you don't know how to do it, you should. Hit the, the link below. I've got some free courses for you who are solo jazz deprived. We have a home studio here where we kind of help people like you figure out how does this work? Like, how do I do it without going out in public and, and like being embarrassed? So if you want to learn how to do it, get off of YouTube and start dancing right now. Get in the game. It's not as hard as it looks. But let me know what you guys think in the comments section. Who do you think won this one? This was a good one. I like it. I got my winner, Christian. He's a man. He crept it. He crushed it on this one. And uh, I think he was the winner for me. Let me know what you guys think in the comments section. And I will see you in class or in the next video. Take care.